It's just amazing that they can achieve that in, in this kind of setting, in Wembley Arena, which is huge. And um, in this kind of... Hello, 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 and welcome back to my channel. Yes, my name's Claire. I'm a flute player from Hull, East Yorkshire in the UK. And, well, it's time to find out whether another track featuring flutes is indeed fully flutiful. So today's track is indeed a band that I've covered before in the past. If you want to see uh, one of my previous reactions to this fabulous band, then do check out the link above. But today's track has been suggested by Helion. Thank you so much for this, who says that this track includes a lot of stunning flute slash whistle play. So I am very excited to hear this. By the way, as well, if you have a track you'd like me to react to, then uh, check out the picture comment below. So today's track is indeed by the fabulous band Nightwish and it's called Alpen Glow. So this is taken from uh, the band's eighth studio album Endless Forms Most Beautiful which was released in 2015 and indeed this live performance is from uh, 2015. It uh, was filmed at Wembley. Um, Fluteful fact for you folks before we get to it, the album was primarily inspired by the work of naturalist Charles Darwin. Um, and the song itself has been called the ultimate Nightwish song by a uh, songwriter and band member Thomas Holpian, who referred to it as a nice little interlude with a catchy chorus and a toxic guitar riff. Whoa, that has really got me excited now. And of course, the fabulous flute whistle playing is going to be by our old friend Troy Donaclay. So without further ado, let's get to it. Here we go. This song, this song just makes you feel great. <laughs> I mean, if you did not already feel much better than earlier today, or maybe even fantastic by now, this song will kick you right into it. How about that?
Oh, I was just thinking I'm going to stop it before we get to uh, before we get to any fluting because uh, I've got so much in my head. But then it happened, and I was like, oh, okay, um, oh, just fabulous. I do love it when we get a flute or a whistle or something uh, doubled with a lead guitar line because to me it's just such an awesome texture. I love it. I love it. So that was super super cool and just executed brilliantly as always by Nightwish. Uh, before we go back to the fluting though, I just want to talk about all the other stuff as much as much as I can remember anyway um what struck me about this is it's that awesome huge sound as we expect from Nightwish but also just there's a there's such an intimacy isn't there that's the word that's popping in my head there's such an intimacy to what they do particularly in a song like this and because I think it's going backwards and forwards from being like big and and drawing you in it's really apparent and I'll tell you how that's happening. One is the camaraderie on stage between them all. I mean, I've talked about this before, but it's just wonderful. It's so great to see musicians um, excited and interacting so well. Um, and the other thing that struck me was, was Flaws. She tells every word. She acts it out. She could almost be in a musical. Um, it's all on her face. I also love the visuals at the back. You you instantly get what this is about, even if you can't hear all the lyrics. This um, this this expanse of of natural landscape, but at the same time, we've been drawn into it. And, and like I keep being thinking, this intimacy is just amazing that they can achieve that in in this kind of setting in Wembley Arena which is huge and um in this kind of song so so that's awesome um I also really loved that little bit of uh, bass line there which was very muse like to my ears I'm a big muse fan as well um and uh, that kind of do 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 moving around bass uh, just before the flute there was the uh, whistle there was was awesome so anyway those are my thoughts so far Let's uh, let's see if there's some more fluting on the horizon. fantastic stuff we didn't get any more fluting though I was I was a little bit disappointed about that I have to say but what we got was well worth it and magnificently done um again we had that contrast there that kind of bringing in the intimacy and then the huge stuff uh wasn't expecting that key shift there that's very uh that was very out of the blue but it kind of made sense because um it's such a catchy driving track that I don't think you need any more material you just want more of it don't you so um so yeah that was awesome um loved the loved the fluting even though there was a tiny bit and um yeah just just excellent stuff as always from Nightwish so thank you very much again to Helion for the suggestion of this if you enjoy my reactions then uh do suggest something yourself I've got a huge list now but I'm always pleased to add to it my only criteria is that it does have uh, a flute in it uh or, or a connected instrument you know related instrument to the flute um so there we are thank you for watching um I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you stay flutiful cheers folks Bye for now!